Are you aware that you can make a reasonable amount of money from this side hustle of adding subtitles to video content? If you go on Fiverr and search for Add Subtitles to Video, you'll see a lot of gigs from people who offer these services. The selling price is quite reasonable and could go as high as $140. And if you do it for a lot of videos, you can make a reasonable amount of money every single day. In this video, I'm going to show how you can create subtitles for any content at all, using some AI tools and free software. These methods are very easy and can be done by anyone. Plus, you can make money by doing it for someone else. I'll also demonstrate how to add hard and soft subtitles to any YouTube video or any type of content using some online tools and video editors, be it Instagram Reels, YouTube videos, TikTok content, Facebook Reels, and so on. Subtitles can be of two different types, the hard and soft subtitles. Technically speaking, the hard subtitle might be regarded as a component of the visual graphic since it is included in the video. Once they are added to a video, hard subtitles cannot be changed. They cannot be turned on or off, they always remain in the state in which they were created. However, soft subtitles are different. They are synchronized text files for a video. These files are equipped with a time coding program that enables them to overlay the relevant text over videos when they are being played back. Closed captions or soft subtitles which is very common on YouTube have the benefit of being able to be translated into any language without losing sync. The script is the first tool on this list. The script has a fancy captions editing tool and a wide range of options for the look and feel of your subtitles. You've probably seen videos with these types of dynamic subtitles. It's very easy to make using Descript AI. Download the Descript software and sign up for a free account. Create a new project and drag and drop your video. The script would automatically go through the video and transcribe the audio. You can now edit the text if you discovered any mistakes. The script will edit the audio and video that correspond to the text you changed. To add subtitles, press Command plus K for Mac users or Control plus K for Windows and type fancy captions. The script will automatically create subtitles for the video. In this right panel you can make a lot of edits to the look and appearance of the subtitles. You can change the text color, font, size, and so on. You'd have to play around with the customization options until you've created something you'd like. Export your video with subtitles or export the subtitles separately to your preferred file format. If you need the subtitles in a specific subtitle format, the script allows for export in both SRT and VTT formats, which can be exported separately from the video itself. Using Veed is the second method. Veed is quite effective at turning text into speech and it also supports a large number of languages. You can use the subtitles feature to automatically create subtitles when you upload your video clip to Veed. Despite the language used in the video, Veed analyzes your video's audio and uses artificial intelligence to create a virtually perfect subtitle. All you have to do is use the subtitles editor to make a few little changes. You have the option of downloading the complete video with hard subtitles burned into it or only the text for the subtitles. A quick Google search will uncover some of the many subtitle making softwares that are available online. However, Veed is one of the best for me because I've only ever encountered very small problems with the tool for creating subtitles. The watermark that appears over the video may have you wondering how to remove it. You must subscribe to a premium edition of Veed in order to remove this watermark, but it is quite worthwhile. Using Canva is the next technique. Canva doesn't have any watermarks nor require any fees or upgrades for the free account. You may add motion graphics-based subtitles to your movies using Canva. To acquire a flawless-looking subtitle, you will need to manually schedule all the text graphics and split up your video because you cannot produce soft subtitles using Canva. To add subtitles using the Canva video editor, you will need to manually type in every sentence in the video you're going to listen to and split the video at the ending of every sentence. The ability to customize each subtitle's form, font, size, placement, color, and animation style as desired is one benefit of utilizing Canva. Additionally, Canva is totally free because you can download 1080p videos without any watermarks and export the final video in any format or orientation. Using ClipChamp is the fourth method. The ability to make soft subtitles is not available in ClipChamp. Only visuals text that will be integrated into the video can be used to generate subtitles. Hard subtitle creation with ClipChamp is very similar to that with Canva. However, ClipChamp is considerably simpler to use because it makes it simple to separate the clips and precisely move the text area around. 
you have complete control over the text size, shape, color, font, position, and animation style, much like Canva. Unlike Canva, you need to pay for a premium subscription in order to export your videos without watermarks, up to 1080p resolution. The fifth method is to use a mobile app called CapCut. CapCut is a completely free mobile video editor that has a lot of features. Unlike desktop video editors, it is lightweight and portable. Additionally, it has a very short learning curve and is accessible and easy to use by literally everyone. Some of the engaging graphics subtitles used in most TikTok content was made using this app. CapCut is preferable if your video clip is under 8 minutes long because it can create subtitles more quickly. I've used CapCut multiple times and it has trouble producing subtitles for videos longer than 8 to 10 minutes. To create subtitles using this mobile app, simply import the video as a new project. Navigate to text tool after selecting the clip. Select auto captions tool and select the original clip audio track. Following that, the subtitles generator automatically uploads a copy of the clip audio file and also downloads the transcribed text as subtitles and precisely arranges them on the timeline. If you want to modify the text style and a few other things, all you need to do is some little tweaking. This is even the best easiest way to add motion graphics to your short video content. After finishing, click export, and your video clip will change from looking blank to having multiple text graphics and subtitles. If you're worried that you may be ripping off people by charging them to create subtitles, you need to understand that some people create tons of content and have very little time left to add subtitles. They're willing to pay someone else to do it. Post your comment below, which tool was your favorite? Don't forget to click on the like and subscribe buttons as well to help us continue to produce videos like this. Thank you for watching, and please click on this video right here if you want to learn how to make motion graphics using Canva alone.